and in business with an eye on improving its digital economy, the Nigerian government has approved a national blockchain policy to enable a secure blockchain-powered economy. The policy, according to the Nigerian government, will institutionalize blockchain technology in Nigeria and ensure its adoption in various sectors such as banking, security, education and commerce. New Central's Adeshawa Odushoga has more. Two years after the Central Bank of Nigeria put a restriction on cryptocurrency transactions in the country, the Nigerian government has now approved the implementation of the National Blockchain Policy for Nigeria. The policy is expected to improve transparency, security, maintain a decentralized record of transactions in cryptocurrency systems and in other sectors of the digital economy in the country. This is amidst a report predicting that the adoption could potentially contribute $1.76 trillion to the global gross domestic product by 2030. We are being proactive to ensure that with the policy, we will increase our talent development, also discover our young innovators, give them all the necessary support they need as provided by Nigeria Startup Act 2022, and also ensure the adoption of the technology, particularly as we know blockchain technology ensures about information integrity or data integrity. Stakeholders in the crypto community, particularly those initially affected by the cryptocurrency restriction, have welcomed this policy with open arms with hopes for wider opportunities and improving investor confidence. As soon as the CBN league the, the bans, I have to just stop. I'm skeptical about it, but with this new policy, it's giving more confidence to CDS. Now, the government has already identified the blockchain, what we are doing in the space, and we can be more comfortable. Government agencies are there to ensure that the, uh, their citizens' funds are being protected. While the approval of the national broadband policy was met with a wide range of acceptance and applause from the players in the digital economy, the implementation of the policy has also raised eyebrows in relation to the e-Naira and the ban on the cryptocurrency transactions. What is the purpose of really introducing the blockchain? Is it just to ride on with a trend being among the first countries to introduce it or do they really want to utilize it? And to what extent will they apply? With the approval of the national blockchain policy, Nigeria joins the United Kingdom, Switzerland, Estonia, Singapore, United Arab Emirates, Denmark, and other leading technology countries in adopting blockchain technology at the national level. Adesha Waudu Shoga, reporting for News Central.